One of the things that we regularly refer to is the WHI study that says, oh, you can't do replacement hormones because it'll lead to cancer uh, or an increase in cancer rates. Mm -hmm. That study has been discounted, uh, but when it was out, doctors and women all over America said, oh my God, we can't do this. And there are still women who believe that. There are still uh, mm -hmm. articles in the newspaper or, or uh, talking heads on TV that will come out and say, oh, you shouldn't do most replacement doctors hormones. Say, I'm not a lot of doctors to don't want to deal with the whole issue mm -hmm. at all. And, and so you've been fighting an uphill battle, you and others like you, to say we have to be aware that that is a discounted study and it, and it was wrong. It was wrong for this reason. I mean, it's know what wrong it was. for lots of reasons because all they said was it, it may cause breast cancer, which we found estrogen doesn't right. cause breast cancer, but it didn't say, but estrogen does all these things, right. all of these good things. Positive they prevent, things. it prevents diabetes, it prevents heart disease. We now know that, we've talked about that. We had mm -hmm. a new study that people who go through menopause early have two and a half times, before 47, have two and a half times the risk of heart disease. Right, and, and, so there, and we did a podcast huge, on that which uh, means a month or so ago. Estrogen is critical to preventing all these illnesses. They didn't even look at that. They just said, oh, let's scare everybody with breast cancer. That's crazy. Yeah. I mean, you should always look at the benefits of taking something and the, and the risks. Well, you shouldn't just look at the risks. You should look at things. Yes. I mean, people Doctors flood emotionally. When, when you hear the word cancer, you shut down and say, oh my God, I'm going to die. If, or, or whoever it is. Or is you're going to be die. disfigured with breast cancer. And most people don't die from it anymore. There, there are so many positive changes. And, and one of the things that we're becoming more aware of is the, the serendipitous positive changes that are coming Mm -hmm. uh, in part as a result of the efforts to discredit the WHI study mm -hmm. because there's so much information that we now have that we didn't have because people are collecting data and looking at things to say, well, how do we connect all these dots?